Hey guys, Tesla just unveiled something really awesome this past week. Welcome back guys to Let's Talk Tesla where we talk everything Tesla. This week, Elon Musk and his pals at uh, Solar City unveiled their new solar roof. Wow, I mean, I have solar in my house. I have the panels, but man, this is just beautiful. Now, I I've had my solar panels in my home for years now, and uh maybe when that thing goes bad or something, I can replace it with this new roof. So, let me show you guys a quick uh samples and highlights of the event if you guys haven't seen it yet. Hey everybody. Hey. <laughs> yeah, no, no fuzzy jack at this time. Um, so the, I will start off uh, by just talking about the, the reason why we're doing this, uh, which is, uh, as you may have read, uh, we're re reaching record CO2 levels. Um, global warming is becoming uh, a serious, is a serious crisis, and, and we need to do something about that. There are really three parts to the solution. Um, so we go to... What, what is the future that, that we want? Um, it consists of a, a really appealing solar roof, um, then combine that with, with storage and with electric cars. So it's, a three, it's an obvious three-part solution. Next slide, please. So, the, so we'd like to introduce the Powerwall 2. The, th this is a, a big step above the Powerwall 1. Um, it has twice as much energy, um, uh, more than twice as much power. So it's a 14, uh, 14 kilowatt hour energy storage, seven kilowatt uh, power output. Um, and just to put that in, in basic terms, uh, you can take a four bedroom house and you can have, uh, you, can, you can power the, your, your fridge, the sockets and lights uh, for a day. And if you have solar on your, on your, on your house, you can power it indefinitely. So, well, as I mentioned earlier, what we're really looking for here is how do we have a, a solar roof that is better than a normal roof, um, that uh, looks better, uh, lasts longer, has better insulation, insulating effect, and where the cost of roof plus electricity is, is less than that of a normal roof. Now, this is, um, this is sort of the integrated future. You've got an electric car, a power wall, and Solar, and a solar roof. I think we've got some close-up shots that we can show. LED. <laughs> so. Okay, can we make a French slate roof that's solar that looks as good or, or better than a, than a conventional uh, French slate roof? And we're able to do that as well. Um, that's done with hydrographic printing. So each tile is unique. So it's, it's, uh, the, the production process itself makes each tile especially unique, a sort of special snowflake tile. This is the, um, so what the French slate hydrographic looks like. You can see that. And here you can really see, as the angle changes, that you can see the solar cells. Um, so, um, <laughs> again, you can see that uh, the transparency changes quite a bit. So as you, fr from the sun's vantage point, which tends to be high angle, you can see the, the, solar, the solar cells, but as you change the angle to a shallow angle, uh, it reverts to um, a, a sort of an orangey color. <laughs> so w one of the other advantages of, of glass is that we can actually make it a lot, a lot tougher uh, and last a lot longer than a conventional roof. Uh, so we just as a demonstration video, show you what happens if you drop a, drop a big weight on a conventional roof tile and one of our glass tiles. So that was just awesome, right? I mean, that's 
really cool. I like the different uh, styles that they have for the different types of roof. So here's the different styles. Like for my home, it'd be this Tuscan glass style. And then there's a slate glass tile, textured glass tile, and the smooth glass tile. And Elon was talking about how cool it is because on on the tiles, like when you're looking at it at a certain angle, it's opaque. But when you're looking directly, if the when the sun is actually uh, directly uh, shining on the solar panel, it's actually transparent. It's so awesome. The breakdown of the roof, the anatomy of the solar roof. There's a, of course, the top part is a tempered glass, and they showed uh, in the video how durable it is when they drop something on it something heavy weight and then there's a color louver film after that in the sandwich and behind that is your high efficiency solar cell it produces energy even during high temperature days awesome the the other thing that tesla announced was the powerwall 2.0 now what do you guys think of this new design of this powerwall it's like a big old, uh, you know, like a rectangle shape, rectangular shape. Who likes the the original one? I, I mean, sad to say, but I kind of like the original one. All right? What do you guys think? Like that design on it. I mean, this is cool, you know. Uh, so the Tesla battery integrates with the solar uh, to harness the the power that the sun gets and hopefully it reduces our reliance on fuel, uh, fossil fuels so again they're selling this uh, through residential homeowners and businesses as well and even utilities because he did talk about uh, Southern California Edison is actually building it's actually near my my, my neighborhood I believe it's in Mira Loma, which is really close to me. So that's kind of neat. Maybe I'll stop by there one day and check it out and see what's going on there. Kind of check out Powerwall too. So with double the energy, it's right. Now it's 14 kilowatts per hour. This. Let's take a look at the new Powerwall. This is Powerwall 2.0. It's compact. It's simple to install. Power uh, Powerwall is a com completely automated system that requires no maintenance. That's... That's really cool. Oh, wow. So I, that's right. This can also be on the floor or it can be mounted on the wall. That's why in the picture right here, you'll see that there's actually legs on it. It's touch safe for the entire family with no live wires or bulky vents. Uh, flexible installation. It can be wall mounted or floor mounted. So you can stack up to nine of these. That's crazy. Durable design. It's water resistant and dust proof enclosure for installation inside or outdoors. Probably gonna install mine inside. And always connected, you can monitor your solar energy use in real time and receive alerts when power wall is, is preparing for a cloudy or severe weather. So let's see what's inside it. There it's a liquid cooled unit. So let's look at this picture here. The connection point, of course, on the left hand side. The battery packs are basically uh three quarters of the entire unit and you, the inverter is went ahead and built in in the unit itself so it's just one big unit if you look at other uh, power walls that uh, DIY people would make and stuff like that you can see all those other uh, the inverters are all out there and everything is all attached to it in this case it's just one big unit really clean design so it's an all-in-one unit with the internal inverter to convert DC energy to AC energy required for our homes. Uh, long life, liquid thermal control system regulates power walls internal temperature to maximize battery performance in any climate. And it's affordable, the most affordable home battery in terms of cost per kilowatt hours. The power wall uh, economically meets the daily energy needs of most homes. Now let's talk about ordering this thing. Now, I have a five-bedroom home. My home is pretty big. Uh, let's see. A three-bedroom home. Uh, you know, look, let's look at this. They, they, they kind of help you out here. How large is your home? One to a three-bedroom home. But there's only three of us that live in this house, so we don't use too much power. 
Because if I mark myself for a five bedroom home, that means two power walls that I need. And you can also choose here. I well, I have solar power. I don't need that. Uh, add that one. Even though I'd love to have the the new Tesla Solar City solar roof, It'd be awesome. One day of backup power for my home, lights, entire home. The lights and sockets would be good in the fridge. That's the biggest thing. Is you want to make sure you keep your um, your food, you know, from spoiling. So if I have to buy two power walls, we're looking at. Eleven thousand dollars, and the installation is a thousand dollars. Twelve thousand dollars for two power walls to run my home. Installation begins January twenty seventeen. Well, that's coming around the corner, but I think I think I can get away with just ordering one. Like again, anyways, if you order one, that doesn't mean you're stuck with that one forever. You can stack another one later on. So when I do make my order, I may more than likely just order one power wall. As my, my, my solar panels generate all this extra power, it goes to the grid. I'd rather have it harnessed, you know, keep it to my, uh, keep it within my, my, uh, my home, right? And charging up the Tesla battery. So that'd be awesome. That would be awesome. So that's the big unveil this week. I did have some people that asked me, hey, did you pick up your car yet? No. Like I said, I want to be documenting this whole process of receiving the car. So this week's update is I got an email back from Tesla factory saying that, hey, we went ahead and made your change. We, we uh, were changing it to Autopilot 2. And now we're going to send it back to the factory so we can put you on queue and we can start building your car. So that's that's my update for this week. Maybe next week I'll have a better updates for you guys so again if you guys enjoyed this video i really appreciate if you give me a thumbs up and also a subscribe would be great as well and i do want to thank you guys for uh watching the videos and i do want to welcome again my elio friends and all you tesla folks please check out elio it it's another uh, it's another good car that that's you know high miles per gallon it's 84 miles per gallon guys check that out you know, it's a it's a great commuter car, and that's what it's aimed for. And we're just trying to focus on getting, I think, like 3,800 more uh, people to put a deposit on it. And I mean, a deposit's 100 bucks. It's it's nothing like, you know, it's not gonna kill you. And for those of you Tesla owners, this car, the Elio, is gonna start at 7,300 dollars. What a bargain, right? So you could flip-flop between taking your Tesla to work one day, right, and take your Elio the other day. Maybe maybe there's a day where you don't have to, you know, drive your wife or carpool with other people. Hey, you can take your Elio. So please, guys, uh, my Tesla uh, viewers, please check out the Elio channel that we have and also support them and vice versa. I am going to say this to my Elio friends to make sure they check out Tesla and they know all about Tesla. So it would be awesome. All right, guys. That is it for this week. Hope you enjoyed it. If you guys have any comments, please comment below. If you have any other questions as well. So have a great week, guys. I will talk to you later. This is Joker88. Thanks for watching. Let's talk Tesla.